Evening Hinch, uh, Harlow this weekend, it would put us eight points clear if we were to get the win and a game in hand. How big of an opportunity is that for the boys? Yeah, it's, it's, it's a massive opportunity. Um, you know, I won't forget sort of leaving their place and being <coughs> seven points behind them at that stage. Um, you know, that was that was a difficult uh, evening to, to to digest really the way we're so far behind them and um, you know to, to turn it around and you know full credit to the players that put us in that position. But you know it's going to be a tough game and um, you know we're going to have to deal with everything they throw at us and and be our best to get anything from them. Looking back to the weekend, obviously another goal for Zach Newton, who's in great form at the moment. Do you see him as a central nine going forward, or is it, is yeah. it a change? I think all his goals have come with him playing as a nine for us. Um, just, you know, been swapping the, those positions around a little bit. Um, but I think we've found the right sort of balance now. I like us when we've got a bit of pace up there, so we can frame him behind. And, I think that's when we look at our best. So when we have got um, Zach up there as a nine, you know, he, he came front and behind. And I'm surprised how good he is with his back to goal as well for like a, you know, a winger, if you like, all his career. He's a, uh, you know, he's quite a stocky lad. He can hold the block for us. So I think it's all the credentials that you'd want from the number nine. Yeah. Obviously, 14 games to go, 34 points accumulated so far. Do you have a number in your head that you need to get to to be safe, or is it just taking uh, game by yeah, game? Yeah, that's, that's, that's how we've done it up until now. It's just game by game. I mean, you know, I, I couldn't really tell you we've got after the next game, just all our focus goes into that. And, you know, it's probably you know, an old cliche, but in our situation, we, we can't really throw away of ourselves. We've just got to focus on the next game. And, you know, put all our emphasis into our next three points and that's what we've done up until now so that's the way we'll continue. We obviously uh, lost the reverse fixture last time at Harlow. Uh, it was a big game at the time as well as losing to two in. Do you think that the team performs better against higher clubs up in the league and when there's not as much pressure on them? Um, yeah, I think that's a fair enough uh, comment really. Um, we, we didn't perform well in them two games. Uh, whether it's because they play a slightly different style or what, I don't really know, but you know, there's, there's no hiding that fact. Um, you know, the nucleus, there's one or two changes to the personnel, but the nucleus of the side has stayed the same. Um, so I don't think we put any added pressure on, on the games. You know, from, from the outset, from the last game that we had, um, you know, we picked that up as a big game and you know, didn't really respond and play well. So. Like I say, we've just been trying to go one game at a time and just put all our emphasis into this, this, this three points coming up. Um, and yeah, hope, hopefully that we don't freeze on the day and we can continue in the, the run that we're on. Brilliant, thanks. Good luck with this one. Cheers, mate.